Welcome to the Step 1 Review Study Guide, and in this video, we learn about lymphatic drainage associations. The right lymphatic duct drains the right side of the head, the right arm, and the right thorax into the right subclavian vein. The right thoracic duct drains the rest of the body into the left subclavian vein. Palpable lymph nodes. The cervical lymph nodes and the supraclavicular lymph nodes drains the head and neck. Related pathology includes upper respiratory infections, mononucleosis, and Kowalski disease. The axillary lymph nodes drains the arms, breast, and skin above the navel. Related pathology includes mastitis, which is breast inflammation, and breast cancer metastasis. The superficial inguinal lymph nodes drains the anal canal below the pectinate line, skin below the navel, scrotum, and vulva. It does not drain the popliteal region. Related pathology are sexually transmitted infections and medial foot and leg cellulitis. The popliteal lymph nodes drains the dorsolateral foot and the posterior calf. Related pathology includes lateral foot and leg cellulitis. The non palpable lymph nodes. The mediastinal and hilar lymph nodes. The mediastinal drains the trachea and the esophagus, while the hilar drains the lungs. Related pathology includes pulmonary tuberculosis, sarcoidosis, which causes granulomas to occur, which are collections of inflammatory cells, primary lung cancer, and chronic granulomatous disease, CGD, which results in catalase positive bacterial infections. The celiac lymph nodes drains the liver, stomach, spleen, pancreas, and upper duodenum. The superior mesenteric lymph node drains the lower duodenum, jejunum, ileum, and colon to the splenic flexure. The inferior mesenteric lymph nodes drains the splenic flexure to the upper rectum. Related pathology includes mesenteric lymph adenitis. The cause is often a viral infection, and the pain associated mimics that of appendicitis. Typhoid fever, which is caused by the bacterium Salmonella typhi, which is spread through water. Ulcerative colitis, which is often presented as left-sided abdominal pain. Hematochesia, which is bloody stools, and fever. And celiac disease, which causes autoimmune destruction in the intestinal villi in response to gluten. The paraaortic lymph nodes drains the testes, ovaries, kidneys, uterus. Related pathology is metastasis. External iliac lymph nodes drains the cervix, superior bladder, and body of uterus. The internal iliac lymph nodes drains the lower rectum to the anal canal, bladder, middle third of the vagina, cervix, and prostate. The external iliac, internal iliac, and superficial inguinal lymph nodes are associated with sexually transmitted infections and medial foot and leg cellulitis. That's all for this video. We'll see you in the next one.